Hi my friends, welcome to the my learning journey about German language. Uh how is that? So hi to we are Villa Lanan, Villa Lanan and Noi Rats we uh and we can uh and we can unseen uh unseen uh, I don't know how to say ability or skill. Uh, so ich wollte so ich wollte so entwickeln mein uh, mein skill anyway like that. Well, uh, no, I'm in bus, but it's not big problem. With mask, I can continue my projects, my plan again. Let's start. So the first, the first word, which is you, okay, you. It's in English, yang, and pronunciation like you. So let's come down. Oh wait. Okay. We can say a uh, hat, which is he has. I mean, young Buddha. Like, like he has a he has a young brother. Like that. Okay. So young. Okay. Let's do. Let's do. Slowly. Another one, which is cut. In English, we're calling it like cult, and our pronunciation like cult. Okay? In Dutch, Dutch. Okay. So let's do our example with there for that. Ich kann nicht wissen, wie kalt es ist. Like I don't know. Like we. How cold, how cold it is. Like, I don't know how cold it is. The weather, we talk about that. Which kind of reason we cold it is. It is that. So if I have some, have some pronunciation problems, just uh, let me know, okay? Then we have kindlich and kindlich. So, which is in English, uh, we have childish or child, like child, like child, like childish or child, like childish or child, like I think something like that. It's kindish and kindish. Let's do the example. What we're calling there? Let's also close this point. Okay, the ist behalten als kindish nicht. We can say she is behaving like uh, childlike uh, to me or like childish something like that so it's like it's, so she's behaving to you like she has some behaving like child okay it's something like that you can say this to my heart and als kindish als here like in like the uh, heart here behavior Kindish is like childlike. Oh. Yeah, let's come in other words. Okay. Another one is kla. Let's check what will be for the kla. In English, it's clear, and in pronunciation, will be like kla. Let's check it together. Okay. Now, anze, anze, anze. How is how is uh, and say a house like our house is say uh, clear like and I think the the, uh, the constructed the constructor uh, construct constructed or infrastructure of this word the sentence is a little bit different but let's try to do with it with the, with this verse like with the clear okay? can be made different and say that. Or anze like our house, as if a house is zia kla, like our house is very clear, like that. Okay. Then another one, that's it, clear, kla, to the algalat. Algalat, which is sleeper, 
which is your so, uh, ground of your house or the another point can be can be sleep sleeper slide okay, sleeper slide I don't know how to English too so I'll be glad to relax like so uh, and then let's do I'll be glad Dutch let's do here here see I'll be glad like here very slight sleeper sleeper slide so we just place a very dangerous to slide can be screw with another one well it's also okay another one will be what Aben Toyalish Aben Toyalish will be Edwin adventures adventures will be like some guys don't living like with the action adventure adventures like so which is we can say aventurelish will be like that pronunciation so like that aventurelish that's our example sentence here sie haben sie ja viel aventurelish geschichte like she have a very or very lot, like very a lot of uh, adventures, uh, life. Okay. So this is I forget. It. <laughs> That's okay. That name I will check it. And I told you still I don't have too much uh, database for my brain for. For the German words, but you need you need to know adventures, okay? So, which is we have here a punish, punish too much important for daily use, which is always we have some pen or something. We can use it too much in English, also using the rate too much for that. Uh, that works. So, a punish, a punish, which is right that a punish. Let's check it. The sentence will be like what? When do have a punish? A punish, gehecht, versuchen, überlegen. When you have dependent, just try to think. Überlegen, überlegen. Überlegen is like medinen, also can be medinen, and also be, can be denken. Dinken, überleben, and Mainen, all the same. Yeah. Überleben, überleben, more representing or recognizing the words which is uh, I think. Versuchen is try, to, and gerecht will be just or merry, merrily, and appenage will be not or dependent, to have, to have, when, if, uh, Okay, let's go up. Appenish. Ich habe, ich habe sehr appenish für Kino. Für Cinema. I don't know. Anyway, then we have aggressive. Aggressive in three languages, which is Turkish, English, German, and other languages are, are, are the same, I think. Let's check it. Aggressive. Some people very aggressive. Uh, Okay. Ich bin nicht aggressiv person. Saying I'm not aggressive person. Aggressive person. Okay. It's easy. You know what I'm saying. Then we have English. Look, Appenish. English too much important for daily use. The English English will be similar, which is always we can compare things and we can say this is similar like to another. So if it is similar to you, it's similar to another thing. Anyway, so you have some similar similarity with, with the another friends and really for eyes for another physical objects we can talk it. We can we can 
can discuss it. Let's say it's also porn English. Let's see. Okay. What is our example here? Like us to be a hub English organ. Organ. It's we saying we have we have similar eyes. Okay. Let's get an example English, which is similar appendage, which is dependent. Let's come here. Anum slow. Now we will check anum gloss, anum slos, anum slos, which is clueless. Uh, you know what I mean, right? So, well, I will go with the example. Let's finish niche anum slos. Like, don't quit me. Uh, like, clueless. So, just give me news like, from you. I need to know more about you, so don't quit me like without clueless, without uh, leaves like that. Let's finish niche, like uh, don't make me, don't quit me, don't be like, don't do something like that. Well, yeah, okay. The, another one will be active. Active is the same in English, active is uh, very well. Or spell or uh, writing like active English active like that pronunciation also same active zin zin do active in internet internet like are you are you active active in internet something like that okay. That's the last one. Align. Align will use too much. The alone, which is align, pronunciation, pronunciating, and dodge, dodge, dodge. Like align. Align will be alone in English. Like you can say I'm alone, or he's alone, man. And you can say I is align. It's the same. The important words here, I mean, primarily, the so this one align English, which is similar, uh, and anang slows maybe. So appendish English align too much important than others. Maybe I will add to for substitute. Well, daily you will use English, appendish, and align English similar appendish dependent align alone. All. I hope you got it all right. Thank you so much for joining. Uh, so, thank you again for joining. Uh, this is end of the adjectives. So, this is part 11, all finished. Mm, we will start another part, which is now I will tell you. Wait for that. Okay. Let me tell you. Yeah. Now we'll start adverbs. Adverb, okay? Adverbs. We'll start for adverb. Uh, our noun finish, pronoun finish, verb finish, adjective finish. Now we'll start adverb. Then we have proposition and conjunction. And we'll go to learn new words. Our grammar points will finish. For speak well. So now. We'll start at work. Be ready for it. Thank you. Have a nice day. I hope you learn it with me. Like me. Thank you.